Hi everyone, um, I'm going to be answering some questions regarding a specific source that I used in my bibliography, tackling the question, um, why are the costs of pharmaceuticals rising and what can we do to help this rise in cost? So I'm just going to answer some specific questions that were asked of us and um, give a little bit more information on my source. Um, so the first question I have here is, why is the source worth reading or watching? Um, Representative Katie Porter, which is a congresswoman, um, she's known for tackling issues with CEOs and the profits that they're making. Um, and in this video, you'll hear exact numbers, such as Mark Alice's compensation for being CEO of Celgene, and the price of Revlimid, which is a cancer drug produced by um, Celgene and how that cost rose from 2005 to 2020. Um, Katie Porter also asks CEO Mark Alice some difficult questions regarding his specific benefits of this price increase. And this is definitely important to understand who's benefiting from the rise of cost of pharmaceuticals. Um, moving on here to the next question, which is, what might its limitations be? So some limitations to consider while watching this video is that it only talks about a small amount of information regarding the company Celgene. Um, you could definitely dive deeper into um, more information on the company. But um, this video does give um, a good tidbit of information regarding um, the CEO and uh, the costs of uh, the specific medication. But you should also take into consideration that uh, Katie Porter represents Orange County specifically, um, which is Orange County, California. So this may not pertain to you or I specifically, but um, nonetheless, this information is definitely important because a small scale of just one company's CEO can lead to many other CEOs of other companies being exposed for their price gouging on pharm pharmaceuticals. Um, and then it could just have a domino effect and hopefully um, open people's eyes to why the cost of medication is rising. Um, and then the last question that is asked of us here is, what value does it offer to inform one of the issue at hand? Um, the value of informing you of the rising cost of pharmaceuticals is that you yourself could be being affected um, or someone you love may be affected by this. Um, someone you love could be in debt due to the cost of their medications. Personally, I have someone dear to my heart that's struggling right now to keep her childhood home due to the cost of uh, their cancer treatments. So it's definitely not fair. It's devastating to watch someone struggle because of an illness that they can't help and that they didn't want. Um, it's even worse to struggle to get the medications that they need because of the cost. Um, there's a lot of people throughout this country that are struggling every day because of the cost of medications that they need. Um, so this is definitely valuable information um, and the amount of CEOs of pharmaceutical companies um, are making lots of money and it's at the cost of their patients. So um, it's definitely some valuable information here and keep an open mind and thanks for listening.